As you know, breakfast is one of the most important meals of the day, and our Hungry Hound says he's found a decadent dish that doubles as a dessert. It's served in Andersonville, but uh, the inspiration for it comes from the West Coast. Steve Delinsky joins us now with more details about it. Steve. Yes, Linda and Sylvia, it does come from the West Coast. Now, we're talking about bread pudding, which is kind of like cilantro. People either love it or hate it. Now, it tends to be served mainly as a dessert, but we found it on a weekend brunch menu up in Andersonville, where I guarantee you'll be hooked after just one bite. Weekend brunch is typically the busiest time of the week at M. Henry, a casual, high-quality breakfast and lunch restaurant in Andersonville. Eggs and other savory options are popular, but a small cult following has developed around Mormon's breakfast bread pudding, which he discovered by chance at the well-regarded Tartine Bakery in San Francisco. I wasn't a real bread pudding fan myself, but after I had that, I would go every morning when we were in San Francisco to have some. And I immediately said, I need to, we need to have one of these, and we need to do our best to copy it and, and make one like it. So we went about trying different brioches and seeing what would work. We really were going for a, a sort of a custardy flan bread pudding topped with fresh fruit cooked off and put right on top. The research and development paid off. Mormon begins with eggy brioche from La Briola. He slices it into even squares or rectangles to fit a deep baking dish, layering it carefully and pressing it down as he goes. In a bowl, he whisks together milk, heavy cream, eggs, and vanilla, then gently pours the mixture over the brioche until the liquid just barely covers it. It's baked in a large oven until the custard is set, and while it cools, Mormon works on the fruit topping. Peaches, blackberries, and simple syrup are heated in a skillet. After a few minutes, he's ready to plate. A giant scoop of the bread pudding is placed into a bowl. Then the peach blackberry mixture with all of its sweet juices is poured over the top, soaking into the custardy brioche below and creating what many customers feel is the perfect beginning to a weekend. We offer half orders. A lot of tables they'll order one and share it for everyone, uh, or they'll do it if they, everyone gets a savory item, they'll have that and finish it off as a dessert. Mm. The breakfast bread pudding is only available on the weekends, and Mormon says he's going to make extra batches this week and next, anticipating the increased demand, because I have such power. And here's the information. M. Henry, 5707 North Clark, 773-561-1600. More information on the website, abc7chicago.com, including Tartine's information if you're ever in San Francisco. Mm. Info line, 312-750-7096. Here is the bread pudding. And so no, good. No joke, mm. I was in San Francisco mm. a year ago, mm -hmm. had the bread pudding, right. came back to Chicago, tasted it at M. Henry, right. asked the owner, is this at all a coincidence? He said, no, we ripped it off from, <laughs> from Tartine. He was inspired by the one he had in San Francisco. It's Which just, is, it is. Oh, this fruit on it. The, yeah, the fruit, fruit is great, is and then of course there's the savory, and there's also the brioche, and it's just yum. Wow. So mm. I'm going to tell you about coming up tonight mm -hmm. at 10 okay. when we continue eating this. Okay. Now, really um, Sunday is Veterans Day. Mm -hmm. yes. You know this, but um, in the food world, there are Look only a handful of true veterans, those that have been around for a quarter century or more. Mm -hmm. We're going to introduce you to three upscale legends. It's my Friday night special tonight at 10. Three places have been around. Actually, one celebrates its 25th anniversary yes. next week. So, yeah, that's from Scallops. That's from the northwest suburbs. That's from yes. the north suburbs. Uh, uh -huh. I'm not going to tell you where. That's <laughs> from uh, somewhere in the city. A little French, little Asian. Oh, all just good. Veal, yum, yum. Mm -hmm. So <laughs> yeah, three places. Right. And actually, one of those places where that video was just from celebrated its 35th anniversary recently. Oh, that's a long, long, a long, long time long, to be in business. Long, 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 and they say five years is a big deal. I mean, 25 is huge. And the photographer gets such beautiful close-ups of the food. Stuff. It makes you look yeah, hungry. Yeah. Okay, thank you. That's delicious. You're welcome. Enjoy. Okay, okay. thanks.